to be or not to be, that is always the question. To be or not to be is always the question. Because if we want to be, we're going to be happy. We're going to be who we are. If we're not going to be, then we are going to do. <laughs> Hello, Nani. Pronam. Light in me bows to the light in you and the light in everyone. Hello, Raf. Top of the day to you, my brother. It's a brand new clean slate. This is Swami Tommy, and you've just come to a stream that is just your dream. The dream of waking up from the dream, right? From the sleep, from the sleep. Ma, will you wake me from this dream? Will you wake me? <laughs> right? So thank you, Marley, for jumping on. Thank you, Lisa, for jumping on. Because all of this adds up. All of your goodness, all of your beingness, all of your beingness, you know? Today is a to make up a to be list. To be, to be. You know, it's such so easy to have a to-do list today and forget the being, and that's why we have stress and worries and fears, and we are tired and on and on. Good morning, Brooke. Good morning, Jeff Ford. Good morning, Natalie. Woohoo, Natalie, Natalie's shining. How can she not shine? Jeff is shining. How can he not shine? Brooke is shining. How can she not shine? She is an immortal and she is being that shine. She is being the love. You are all just being this. Today we need to make a to, to be list. To be. Just to be list. How do we want to be? You know, how do we want to feel? How? What is the experience that we want to have rather than just a doing that is, you know, a doing where the consciousness isn't riveted on the truth of us. So we're going to go through a little to be list this morning if you guys want to join me because as you be and I be, then our world's going to be and maybe we can just rest in peace today, the whole world, you know. Maybe we can all just rest in our true nature today because I, you know, my mom and my, and my wife's mom is there and they can hardly move and they can hardly cognize anything and they're ready to go. They're ready to slip into the infinite. And so what does that say that at any moment, you know, your battery could be drained today or something happens and you're, and everything changes, everything shifts and you can't do. And all you can do is be, I mean, I think, I think the good Lord is telling us something there. Don't you all? I do. I am the almighty power of spirit. I am the almighty power of spirit. I am, I am. I am. Hey, let's just start with that. We are the almighty power of spirit. Unplug from the, from the world and plug into the source socket, okay? Just unplug. Shift your identity because what we have here is a, is a, a case of mistaken identity, kids. A case of mistaken identity. That's all there is. And you know, the first thing that we need to do as we meditate in the morning is to remember who we are, remember our oneness with spirit, and to then just put on our, on our radar what is our highest purpose of this day. First step, first step is, you know, remember who you are, remember, remember who you are, because if you go out of the house today as a doer, if you go out of the house today with a whole list of, of, of something to do and to, problems to solve, you're going to be stressed out, baby. <laughs> right? So listen. We are the almighty power of spirit. Right? We are the almighty power of spirit. We are, we are. We are, we are, we are, we are, we are one, 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 we are the almighty power of spirit. We are the almighty power of spirit. We are, we are, yes, we are. We are, we are, yes, we are. Hey, I'm sorry it doesn't look like 
like anyone can hear me. <laughs> Hello there. We're just doing a to-be list, but I'm going to continue the stream. I'm sorry I don't have any live folks on here. It says live and everything's live, but this world is full of tricks, right? So, but first step is to just affirm, remember who you are. We are the almighty power of spirit. Spirit and I are one. Spirit and I are one. And I do believe that my highest purpose today, my highest purpose today, really. Why wait? Why wait? Why wait? Why wait? Oh, my soul and spirit. Oh, my soul and spirit. When tis now we can meet. When tis now we can meet. And melt in the ocean heart of oneness. Of oneness everlasting. The ocean heart of oneness. Of oneness everlasting. I do believe our highest purpose is to just be ready at, you know, willing and able and, you know, if spirit and us are one, if we are the Almighty's power of spirit, then why delay? Why wait? Why wait? Why wait? Why wait? Why wait? Oh, my soul and spirit. Oh, my soul and spirit when tis now we can meet when tis now we can meet and melt in the ocean heart of oneness of oneness everlasting the ocean heart of oneness of oneness everlasting why wait, why wait, why wait, why wait? Oh, my soul and spirit, oh, my soul and spirit. When tis now we can be, when tis now we can be, and melt in the ocean heart. Why wait? We don't want to wait today. I see so, so, so much. What does it say? Ho, oh, ha, ha, Mother Maya, catch, catch this after recording. Thanks and have a beautiful day. Whatever. I don't know why it ain't helping us to be live, but we are live. And you can watch later and we can have, have the same experience whether we are on a line or off of a line because we are really in the love force always and forever, my dear soul friends. And I so thank you for jumping on this love line this morning, but I can see see you for a change. Usually I don't have your comments, but I get your comments, but for some reason the, the good Lord is, is blocking this, this contact, although I do see some hearts, so maybe something just shifted. Maybe maybe the, the light beams, you know, we have light beams and love blasts coming from our, our light beams and our love blasts from the third chakra, and they're just like all the time streaming, although sometimes we may not know it, right? So today is to come up with just beingness, just beingness, so that we can, when we see each other, know that, wow, it's the most, it's the highlight of forever. It's a one-of-a-kind experience. I mean, when you physically see someone, because usually we're so in the to-do list that we pass each other, we're too busy to stop. And it's got to change. It's got to change. Because otherwise, we're going to be, we're going to be, 
No interruption. Yay! Ha ha ha! Hello, Dana. Oh my gosh, there's no interruption on the love line. Woohoo! <laughs> We're riding, riding on the love line all the way back to the divine. We're riding, riding on the love line all the way back to the divine. Woohoo! Together. But listen, I don't want to have to greet you on the other side. You hear what I'm saying? When I see people and I'm just so filled with love and, you know, it's so easy to get dumpy in life. It's so easy and it's so hard. A little elevation is so hard, right? And a little elevation is so easy to lose. It's so hard to be elevated and so easy to lose. So listen, if you're a type of person that's getting more elevated these days and happier, don't lose it for anything in the world. I don't care what other people say if they don't have time for you or they just don't think that you're real and all the other stuff, baby doll. It's so hard to stay high. It's so hard for elevation. And once you get it, baby doll, you hold it, okay? You don't let yourself down because that's your highest obligation on the planet. And you can be that. And then you let the whole universe Almighty power of spirit, just totally be you. You let divine mother's love totally be you. You let everything just be you as you stay higher and higher and higher and help lift up our brothers and sisters because the more the high part of, of us can lift up, the more the low part lifts up, okay? And you know, so many people go down to the low part and then going to the low part, the consciousness drops and then they're in the low part and, it's a, and everyone needs help from there. <laughs> Everyone needs help from there. But I am telling you, when you see someone today, you make sure that you're seeing them for the first time and you are just this amazing, loving friend. Just be a friend to everyone. Just be. Just be. Just be a friend. You know? Just be a friend. Just be someone who just really loves that person, right? Just be a person who just is love and friendship. That's it. It is startling to people. They're not ready for it. They're on a different wavelength, but that's okay because we as soul rebels can be on a wavelength where we are riding the same wave like dolphins, baby, right? <laughs> Let's do that. You're my first love since the beginning of time You're the only one, you've always been mine You're my first love, now I'm first in line To give you all I am Because you're my first love You know, it's all about this first love idea It's your first love, it's ah, 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 in here in here, love from Kenneth and Karen. Hello, Kenneth and Karen. Whoa, love to you, Amy, to Vermont and from Vermont and to all the world. It's all splattering out at once. It's all simultaneous. It's all a, a big soul chasm that we're experiencing of truth this morning. And it's just a being. It's an experience, kids. It's an experience, right? We have to remember who we are really set on our radar our highest purpose for today so we already ex we said that the almighty power of spirit we are and the highest purpose is why wait oh my soul and spirit right and then to re and then to all and then to go after this day or have have the truth reveal itself that there's just one beloved there's just one first love and we got to keep first things first right we got to keep hello Kathleen Trish and I were talking about you last night we were actually loving about you. There's no more talking about. There's no more working. There's, 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 there's love. There's love. I go to love. I don't go to work, right? I don't work out. I love out. And I don't talk about someone. I love about someone, okay? That's all there is. You're my first love since the beginning of time. You're the only one. You've always been mine. You're my first love, now I'm first in line to give you all I am. Because you're my first love, because you're my first love. You're my first love since the beginning of time. You're the only one, you've always been mine. You're my first love, now I'm first in line. You're my 
first love, now I'm first in line to give you all I am, because you're my first love, because you're my first We are all each other's first love, there's only one love. We are all each other's first love. First love comes first today, over the doing. You're going to be doing what you let the Divine Mother do through you, her amazing grace. You all know that, right? That you can't do a thing on your own. How many people do we need to go see? Because my mom and Trisha's mom is exactly the same place right now. They open their eyes and they can just barely see you. They probably don't understand much of what you're saying, or maybe they do. They can't, re they can't talk back. And it's just like, okay, thank you, Lord. So we sh how many millions do we need to go see today? We should go and visit all those people who can't move. We should go visit all those people who just had something happen and their whole life shifted and all the doing that they had to do. It's got to stop on a dime and everything shifts and changes. So tell me, my friends, what do you need to have happen to you to remember the truth that you're not a doer and it's time to be and receive and believe and to walk around like this is the last day on our planet and baby oh baby we need to shine and to love and be a friend every moment every person everything that we do today should be about our first love you're my first love since the beginning of time since the beginning of time you're the only one we all had our first little love of love affections didn't we in life your first love human love we're talking about the forever love you're my first love since the beginning of time you're the only one you've always been mine see there's one love that has never left your side ever there's one beloved who has never left you we come and go have you guys Sharam good morning have you guys realized that there's nothing that anyone can do for you and really you can't do for them that you are helpless when something goes awry you are helpless we are helpless to really ourselves. We are helpless to others and they are helpless to themselves and they are helpless to others. Do you guys realize how dependent we are on that higher self? Don't you realize that? Can you help me to realize that today and I will help you to realize that today as we put together a to be list and not leave from this after this stream. We don't leave and do anything today until we have exactly the to be that we are going to be today. We are going to be the beloved to the beloved and the beloved is going to be the beloved to us their first love our first love our first love is the only purpose of creation one love one heart one joy one family one tribe it's very simple now kids just breathe and be just breathe receive believe and be just breathe receive believe and just be just breathe receive Believe and just be. Just breathe, believe, re receive and believe and just be. Just breathe, receive this beautiful first love energy and exhale, believe and just be and just be today and make sure you have time for yourself today. Time for yourself every minute, every footstep that you take today that you have time for yourself. Yourself is immortal. Yourself is the one supreme spirit that is you, the divine mother as you, all the soul qualities as you so that then you can really make sure you see other other people and stop on a dime to be there to be a friend to be that first love for them to be everything and just make sure you don't wait until you greet all your loved ones that you have in your life now on the other side to realize this truth will you promise me Many of us will be on the other side realizing this and going, wow, there was some bald-headed guy talking about this and I heard it with my own ears, but for some reason I just couldn't get out of the to-do mode. But yes, we are going to get out of the to-do mode because at any second in this life we're in a to-be mode. And in some cases, that to be mode that we are in is in the embrace of the divine light and the divine love, okay? Doesn't that make perfect sense? You're my first love since the beginning of time. You're the only one, you've always been mine. You're my first love, now I'm first in line. 
to give you all I am because you're my first love to give you all I am because you're my first love to give you all I am because you're With every breath I breathe in your pure love. So that first love, every breath is the first love. Every breath, as far as the beloved of this universe is concerned, is the very first moment that you are you are you are thought of in the consciousness of that divine bliss. And your soul became individualized. From that moment on, you have been the first love and the lover that lives in your heart. You have been the first love. So every breath that comes in is the first lover's breath. You are receiving the divine beloved's breath. The first powerful moment that it loved you eternally, blissfully, forever and forever is every breath that you receive. Would you all p please breathe again? And please receive again? And please believe again and just be again? Can you just pause enough? I know your mind is racing. I know that there's you might be late for things. I know that the to do, the to do, the to do is still a gigantic monster on you. And even though your life force is draining and you're feeling not so, so satisfied at the end of the day, and maybe a little a little guilt is kind of like, as a chronic little guilt. Thing going on there. Why? Because as soon as we forget first love, as soon as we forget who we are, as soon as we forget our highest purpose, as soon as we forget just to be, we're not here to do. We are already existing in the almighty power of spirit. Let that be the thing that does the doing, would you? So we do, if we forget that, everything goes askew. Everything doesn't work right. Everything is, 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 the, is the suffering and the misery and all the illnesses and the addictions that are happening on the planet, the killings, the starvation, all of it, all of it. Don't you see how important this first love? With every breath I breathe in your pure love. So now it's a breath by breath love affair, okay? It's a breath. I know. Well, this is why you come on this station, Christine Perry and Dana, because we get a little perspective. Otherwise, we're like this. We walk along like this. We got our own little thing going on, and that little thing is a dangerous thing, and we've got to actually throw it into a sacred fire and burn it and burn along with it. The sacred flames, you know, we need immortal flame, immortal flames. I am immortal flames. I have immortal flames of spirit. I have t-shirts, right? We need banners. I am immortal flames of spirit. And every thought and every action and every, every temptation and every addiction gets burned. It gets burned on the spot because we walk around as I am immortal flames of infinite spirit. I am immortal flame. It's just a fire. We are flames. We are flames. So, so we burn the little knowledge is, is what I'm saying. <laughs> So that we can be open and, re and receptive to breathe, receive, believe, and just be. To breathe, to receive, to believe, and just be. All right? Pretty good message. Just breathe, receive, believe, and just be. Just be. To be less now. We are making up to, our, to be less now. As the number one lister, as the A lister to be, how am I going to be today? And we have on these streams all the ways to be. Very little to do, very little to do, all to be. With every breath I breathe in your pure love. With every breath I breathe in your pure love, your everlasting love. With every breath I breathe in your pure love, I live on divine love support. I live on divine love support. You love me and you love me more. You love me and you love me more. That's the first love, the one beloved of all of us. You love me and you love me. 
love me and you love me more. With every breath I breathe in your pure love, with every breath I breathe in your pure love, your everlasting love, your everlasting love. With every breath I breathe in your pure love, I live on the We live on divine love support. We live on divine love support. Good morning, Taylor. Oh, Taylor, we get to just breathe today. We get to receive love with every breath, Taylor. We get to just believe with all our heart and soul that we are one with that cosmic lover. We are the almighty power of spirit. We are divine mother's amazing grace. And then we just be, we just be. You know, because to me, this life is so cruel. The delusion is so cruel. It's a dream, yes, and it's temporary, but boy, that temporary could be hundreds of lifetimes, you know? It's so cruel. We get so caught up in our doing. We get so caught up. And in a moment, life can change. In a moment, you're gone from the body. In a moment, you have something go wrong and you can't do what you, what you were doing. You cannot do it or your loved one can't do it anymore. And then you're helpless. You know, listen, you came in here with diapers. You're going to leave with diapers if you stay old enough, like my mom and Trisha's mom, in diapers. Hello, good human. So kids, we need to stay in diapers. Yes, we need to be in diapers now. Do we, we need to be helpless and humble. We need to let go of all our doing and all our desires to do and all of our attachment to the fruits of actions and all the running around. For what? You're still going to do it because we need to survive on this 3D plane. We need to play the game of, of you know, of, of dealing with this 3D reality, but you don't play the game by being in the game and identified with the game. You play the game by being who you really are, an immortal, right? You play the game because why wait, oh my soul and spirit, when tis now, we can meet and melt in the ocean heart of oneness everlasting. That's your highest purpose. That's the goal well, every, every day when you leave your house. Why wait, oh my soul and spirit? And then we just remember the first love. We breathe. We receive, we believe, and we just be that we are in this cosmic love affair with breath. And then with every breath, we just breathe it in. All right? So, so that, is, that is our M.O. That is our M.O. So we are helpless in the amazing grace and the humility of being totally dependent on source. We are in assisted living with source, and that is the way it is designed. As soon as you think that you can go out in this 3D world and, and survive on your own and do what you want to do and forget this, ah, doggone it, man. That's okay, and you'll learn. You'll learn the hard way, but you don't have to learn the hard way no more. You really don't have to learn the hard way no more. It makes so much sense to drop the nonsense So I can see super clearly It makes so much sense to drop the nonsense So I can see super clearly Clarity of mind and clarity of heart Clarity for Clarity of mind and clarity of heart, clarity for my soul, cause I love to see you, I love you, cause I We've got to drop the nonsense of doers. We've got to drop the nonsense of our to-do list. We've got to drop the nonsense that we have to be like every other scurrying around, stressed out, 
seemingly human person but really an immortal soul in complete delusion? Do we need to be that way? Just, and when people, when, as soon as you strive, when as soon as you strive to better yourself and to become more awakened and, or, and just that next level, it seems like the whole world is going to try to bring you down, baby doll. And if you're not careful, you're going to doubt yourself and think it's not worth it to keep lifting higher and higher. And you might even then forsake the notion that you can be happy, really happy, because nobody else wants to be happy. You might even forsake the notion that you can be in love all the time because others aren't in love and they're in divorces. And the pain wants to bring you down. All right, so here is one opportunity. We have one opportunity right here on this station this morning to just get elevated. You know, we have to med meditate to elevate. We have to join a society of, of people who want to elevate or are trying to stay higher and elevate so that our frequency stays high as a collective. Do you see what I'm saying? So it makes so much sense to drop the nonsense. Drop it. Drop this delusion nonsense. Drop it. Drop it. It's got us. It's got our world. There's too much suffering. Something's got to give here, baby. And one way is to drop the nonsense. So we can see super clearly. It makes so much sense to drop the nonsense. So we can see super clearly. Oh, clarity of mind. And clarity of heart, and clarity for our souls, clarity of mind, and clarity of heart, clarity for our souls. Why? So I can see you today, stop you in your tracks in case you are running the other way, got something to do. I've got this coming up, sorry, I really can't spend a quality moment with you. Are you kidding me? If we can't be that way with human, how are you going to be that way to the one beloved who's, who's the only reality that is the quality moment and endless moments that aren't even moments, they're just bliss. They're just this consciousness of bliss, right? Because I love to see you. other and all of us are seeing the world and all of us are what we just breathe receive that pure love of the one beloved's love for us that cosmic lovers love breath and we exhale we believe that we can now just be feel the love with us please feel the hope with us please feel this potential please and if you need to sh shed a tear go ahead and shed a tear because it's been a long and windy road my dear and it's still a long and windy road for many other souls I just hope and pray and that's why I stream I love I light beam and I love stream I light beam and I love stream every day that our road not be so long and windy, that it becomes straight and clear, super clear, and then we can truly see. I love you. I truly do. <laughs>